In 1903, the first powered aircraft took to the air. It held one man, could barely reach 30 miles per hour, and flew just 36.5 meters. Fast forward through 100 plus years of aviation progress and now we have aircraft with wingspans in excess of the distance covered in that very first flight and that can carry up to 850 people 15,000 kilometers without effort. We have aircraft that can greatly exceed the speed of sound, that can maneuver in ways that seem to almost defy the laws of physics, that can take off and land without runways that can lift astounding weights. One can even go into space. And some don't need pilots at all. The world of aerospace is as diverse as it is exciting and has always been at the cutting edge of innovation and technology. Constant developments are being made to aircraft design and propulsion systems, to the creation of more efficient fuels and materials that can bear massive stresses and loads while remaining as light as possible. Some of the world's most sophisticated digital technology is used for aircraft design and training or to enhance control, navigation, communication and safety systems. All things that are part of an evolution greatly accelerated by the constant and growing demands of both military and commercial aviation. Aerospace is a sector that will continue to evolve and grow. And as it does, so too will the demand for skilled professionals to work within it. To work in aerospace is to work in one of the most dynamic, expanding, challenging and responsible industries possible. Everybody from aircraft manufacturers to the air crew that fly them, the air traffic controllers that guide them, to the maintenance and support that keeps them in the air has to be at the top of their game at all times. Because if something goes wrong at 30,000 feet, there's no lay-by to pull into. Hartlepool College of Further Education now offers an innovative introduction to the field of aircraft maintenance and development. It is a career path that is both exciting and potentially high in rewards not only financially, but in terms of job satisfaction and interest too. The college's track record in other forms of engineering it delivers is impressive, with success rates far higher than any other institution in the Tees Valley and way above the national norm. The Learning and Skills Council has recognised Hartlepool College as one of the highest performing training establishments in the country and our facilities have been rated as outstanding by Ofsted the body responsible for inspecting the standards of all education providers in England. This is the highest grade possible. The new aerospace provision at Hartlepool College allows students with an interest in aircraft, technology, engineering or science the chance to gain a thorough grounding in the skills and knowledge they will need if they have ambitions to work in the aviation sector. The course tutors have all genuine expertise and experience in aerospace disciplines as well as being friendly, approachable and supportive. Under their guidance, students will study the principles, science and maths of flight and flying technology as well as maintenance and avionics systems. But as vital as all of this, the course is far from purely academic. The best way to learn about real aircraft, of course, is to work with real aircraft. And Hartlepool College has made sure that this course provides plenty of opportunity. In our main aviation workshop, students will have the access to a variety of aircraft components that allow them to learn the principles of key areas such as propulsion, landing and control systems. 
However, far more impressive is an entire former Royal Air Force Jet Provost T5, bought especially for students to work on, which allows them to learn not only about the aircraft itself, but also the safety protocols and teamwork essential for this kind of highly specialised and disciplined environment. The college has also forged some impressive partnerships to enhance the student experience further. Rolls-Royce is a name known throughout the world for their luxury cars, but they are also leaders in aviation propulsion. Indeed, it was Rolls-Royce engines like the famous Merlin that powered many of the most capable aircraft of World War II, like the Avro Lancaster, the North American P-51 Mustang, and the legendary Supermarine Spitfire. With several of these crafts still flying after nearly seven decades, some lucky engineers even get to work on these amazing vintage power plants. It may be that one day that some of our students will help keep these important pieces of aviation heritage where they belong, in the air. For now though, they get something a little bigger and more commonplace to enhance their skills on. A Rolls-Royce engine from a Boeing 747 airliner, courtesy of the company. Another of the biggest names in aviation is Babcock International Group, a company with a track record in engineering and defence services stretching back well over a century. Amongst many other roles, Babcock provides maintenance and ground services to the Royal Air Force's entire fleet of BAE Hawk aircraft. Operated by 16 countries around the world, the Hawk is a superb fast attack jet used by the RAF as a trainer, but which also has a formidable specification as a combat aircraft. The United States Navy even operate it from aircraft carriers. It is also flown by the world-famous RAF Red Arrows aerobatic display team, proof if needed of its incredible performance and handling capabilities. The Hawk is a very common sight in the skies of North Yorkshire, where it is operated from RAF Leeming by RAF 100 Squadron, founded in 1917 and flying under the motto, Don't stir up the hornet's nest. Equipped with this sleek, nimble fighter, the air crews of 100 Squadron work closely with the ground crews of Babcock to keep both their aircraft and flying schedules at peak efficiency. With many sorties required every day, keeping the Hawks in top condition and in the right place at the right time is a round-the-clock job that requires maximum dedication, attention to detail and safety awareness. The atmosphere of a working airbase like Leeming is highly charged and always busy, and Hartlepool College students make frequent visits, working directly with both military and civilian personnel as they gain valuable experience in a genuine operational aircraft environment. There is even the possibility of apprenticeships and placements. RAF Leeming also offers the chance for college students to participate in team building and fitness exercises with RAF physical training instructors. Two activities that always prove highly popular, if not a little challenging. And also popular is the chance to visit Toulouse in France, home of Airbus Industries, to see the construction of the incredible Airbus A380, the largest civil aircraft ever constructed and one of the most technologically sophisticated. Successful completion of Hartlepool's College Aerospace course leaves open a wide array of options for an exciting and challenging career. But whichever way you choose to end your learning, Hartlepool College's aerospace engineering provision is the best place to take off from. We have the facilities, we have the expertise, we have the contacts, and we have the opportunities our students need to help them reach for the sky.